Welcome back, Julie Martin, to Talk of the Town. She, as you know, is owner of the company called Retire Ready Hilton Head. Good to have you back. It's great to be back. <laughs> I was just saying, I'm a little tired, know. you know, but we've had an amazing RBC Heritage Week, haven't it we? It was. It great was, tournament. Really, the weather was good, except for Thursday. Well, that but was, it was just a one-off. Yeah, it was one-off. a one-off. Yeah. But it was exciting and... But I was really glad yesterday morning to be sitting at my desk and working <laughs> and doing real work. So it's good you know, to be back. Let's start, Julie, with our viewers that might not know what Retire Ready Hilton Head yeah, is. Yeah, so I'm a retirement coach and I help people plan for everyday life in retirement outside of the financial planning. So mm -hmm. I help them, you know, keep their, mm -hmm. maintain their identity, have a purpose, right. you know, why, why they wake up in the morning and right. when they realize they're playing too much golf and they want to do something else, I help them with that. And right. today I'm going to talk about the curiosity list. It's I, I, and I'm curious. I'm curious about the curiosity list. You know, I'm looking at some of your notes, mm -hmm. but it is, uh, I think, something all of us need to be thinking yeah. about. Yeah, so and it's part of the through. overall wellness approach that I use in, in my workbook, but that is one activity that I think is worth mentioning. It's, you know, when sometimes, you know, you have a few minutes in a day or a couple hours or a full day and you just don't know what to do with yourself. You right. know, it's like right. you, and then you're like, you know, there's a restaurant you've been wanting to try or somewhere you've, and you just right. forget what it is. Mm -hmm. Well, the curiosity list basically helps you put that in perspective because if you're soon to be retired or have mm -hmm. been retired and you have more time on your hands, because mm -hmm. I know we all do, or mm -hmm. you're an empty nester now or whatnot, mm -hmm. it's nice to have that list to fall back on. Doesn't mean you're going to do everything on the list, but it's just ideas that you might want to look into. It's not right. a bucket list. Right. And so what is the difference? The, the bucket lists are the big, those big, I, I, I don't like the term bucket list because it's like you're going to kick the <laughs> right. bucket and it's right. like it's, it's, is it, it's I guess that's done. why it's called you're bucket done. list. Yeah. Right. And you're never done. Right. Curiosity list is those things that you've been wanting to do and um, but you never had the time to do it and you want to research them a research little bit more. It and maybe dabble in yep. it. Like so we maybe. start the cure, you dabble in it and you say, Ma, I'd like to spend more time doing mm -hmm. this. Mm -hmm. This Because remember, you're soon to have, you know, hours on the day, days mm -hmm. in the week, lots of weeks, mm -hmm. lots of months into your retirement. So you've got to, you've yeah. got to fill that time in a fulfilling way. So give us some examples of what might be on your curiosity list. Good way of some, well, some examples, some, I'll give you me as an example. I I played piano when I was young. Yeah. Okay. I don't play the piano anymore, but that is something that has been you on my revisit? I want to revisit playing the piano. Okay. Taking, I have actually a good friend who just <laughs> retired who has been taking piano lessons and he loves it. So that's an example, but some people may want to pick up golf, you know, okay. some people may want to pick up pickleball. So I always recommend start at the rec center if you don't know where to start. Right. Or some people f spend a lot of time on Facebook. And right. see what their friends just, or people are doing. They right. might have to be curious about mm -hmm. some of those things. Put those things on your list. And see, for me, it's going some places like I haven't been to Pinckney Island, just a hike. Well, that would so be a good I need curi to put that That's on, not a bucket I'm item it's list. Not, no, it's, it's, it's a it's, curiosity. It's a, I'm curious to see what everybody says. Oh, it's a fabulous place to hike. <laughs> but I, if, unless I write it down and say, okay, the, yeah, this so week. The curiosity <laughs> list literally is you write things down. Okay, it's, perfect. It's a curious list in here. Okay. And it could, this is, it gives you 50. But you, in real life, you know, this is a start when we work together right. as with my clients. This is a start. It gives ideas. But there, and there might be things that you research and you're like, eh, no, not so much. And right. you cross it off and you move on. But what's cool is that it's somewhere. It's a system that you can keep and you have it there when you're ready. And when you're coaching folks, do you do this in like one session or is it just kind of an ongoing? No, we started in our session. It's part of my retirement wellness plan. So we'll start it. Okay. They might get five or 10 or whatnot, but eventually it becomes a, a living list. You know, so they, they're responsible for continuing it and, and whatnot. And we just, unfortunately, we have like 45 seconds left. <laughs> That's but, okay. But for some on their curiosity list would be, I'm curious about that nonprofit. Maybe I want to volunteer there. Nonprofits are huge on Hilton Head. I the know. best, and I, I want to take those few seconds that I have. Um, the Community Foundation of the Low Country mm -hmm. is basically what I call the clearinghouse for all nonprofits. Right. So they have a website mm -hmm. and they have a, a section on their website that lists all the nonprofits and what type of volunteer 
volunteerism that okay, you can do. Okay, interesting. So you know a lot of those yes. nonprofits want right on, and a lot of people are curious about wanting to do things with nonprofits, so that would be the best okay. place to start. Okay, perfect. Yep. All right. All right. So As <laughs> always, my website's available. Please reach out to me if you'd like this part of your retirement wellness plan, but I, I love working on the curious list because I get curious about things well, that my client, client gets uh, curious about. I need to about. start working on my list right now. <laughs> there you go. Thanks, Julie. Thank you. And I'll see you next time. Relax. Month. Yeah, I know. You can do breathe now. I, the I'm like the Energizer Bunny. Some <laughs> people say, hey, so, but I'm, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. Julie Martin with Retire Ready. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, hon. Thanks. Thanks.